what's up guys today we're going to change spark plugs on a r33 gtst rb25 skyline uh, what you're going to need is spark plugs normal cheap bcpr 70s plugs and a feeler gauge and obviously your recommended normal tools a happy plug it doesn't look like it's burning nice anymore and it's got a little bit of oil on it and i think um the motor's breathing it's going to need a new engine soon uh, by the way this car did catch a light not long ago i think a few months back um, we were on the track doing hot laps, testing the car. It was actually a challenge between myself, Jude, and Chase. And that's, if you're wondering why it looks so tacky, it's because it caught a light. Have a look at this. There's still like residue from the fire extinguisher inside the coil packs. I haven't changed plugs since then. I've serviced the car with just an oil change. And if you have a look here, is where the fire was from the methanol. So this methanol pipe over here, it actually like perished and had a pinhole which caused the fire on the downpipe over here and my ABS lights always on now I had to cut and join and rejoin wires and my aircon doesn't work my heater box doesn't work and yeah 10,000 K since car still going strong okay so we're looking at the plugs over here that one looks like it's burning quite nice actually that one's also not too bad, it's burning quite nice. The gaps are very, very small. And the gaps are at 0 0.5 so that it doesn't blow the boost out. That one's also running quite nice. That one's quite nice. It looks like it's just cylinder number one that's not happy. Looking at it actually, number one plug doesn't look good at all. That's number one, it's got oil. And I don't know what that is, but it doesn't look good. And you go, BCPR, 7 years. Okay, it's time now to put the spark plug back in the hole where they belong and test plug in.
There's a pipe. Thank you. And um, take it for a test drive, see what it does. But I'm pretty sure it's, it'll be good. As you can see, the signs of the one spark plug was the problem. And um, yeah, next uh, on, on the list, you'll probably be seeing a lot of this one over here. We just, just sprayed up the mirrors now. Uh, I'm going to do a, a full sticker kit on it. Done the, the back calipers. Uh, we've done the front calipers, we have done the engine tap it cover. So we still got lots of playing around to do, but let me just open this up and show you what's inside. Always a tricky one to open. Oh yeah, buddy. So we just done that. Um, front calipers are done. So I just pulled over to the, on the side of the road because my spark plugs are working perfectly fine but i forgot to tighten one of the clamps on the boost pipe so it's in gear here we go let's start it up seems all right i'll give it a close my door before i fall out seems all right let's give it a little second get pulled So there you have it. Spark plugs work. Spark plugs work. The gaps before it is on 0.55 now of a mil. It was at 0.45 previously, and uh, it makes sense why it used to struggle to start. It was gapped way too small. There you go, folks. Have a lovely day.